force all measures, in particular border closures and strict travel bans and asset freeze, on all persons or groups of individuals whose actions hinder all peaceful efforts aimed at ensuring the smooth and complete restoration of constitutional order. Warn member states who, by their action directly or indirectly, hindered the peaceful resolution of the crisis in Niger about the consequences for their action before the community. Call on the African Union to endorse all the decisions taken by the ECOWAS authority on the situation in Niger. Further call on all partner countries and institutions, including the United Nations, to support ECOWAS in its effort to ensure a quick restoration of constitutional order in conformity with its normative instruments. Direct the President of the Commission to monitor the implementation of the sanctions. Direct the Committee of the Chief of Defense Staff to activate the ECWA standby force with all its elements immediately. This summit is a testament to the power of collaboration and unity. We have reaffirmed our commitment to the people of Niger and to the progress of our entire ECOWAS community. We will continue with that. And you will see from the community of this extraordinary summit that no option is taken off the table, including the use of force as a last resort. 